Do not forget, that's the motto of these women who turn their white handscarves into their symbol. They are still searching for their children, who disappeared back in the late 70s and early 80s during Argentina's dictatorship. Their fight has become a symbol of perseverance and dignity. It seems unreal to us, but we are still fighting. And we know people think we're crazy, still looking for our children. I wish the mothers of the Plaza de Mayo did not have to exist, because that would mean that there were not over 30,000 people who disappeared. We saw the strength of the resistance against oblivion, and we do not want to change the real history. History is what we all carry inside. The mothers of Plaza de Mayo organized a fundraising lunch during which human rights organizations, artists, and politicians pay tribute to the 30,000 people who disappeared. It really is an exciting day because we are commemorating one of the milestones in Argentinian history. It's a moral milestone. We have the duty to remember and pay tribute because this is what gives us the chance to think independently and not relive the darkest days of the dictatorship. The mothers of Plaza de Mayo also opened their main office to the public to show people their fight and the awards they have received since 1977. It's a celebration day because not every day it's a commemoration of 41 years of fight. This means not having given up, not even for a day, the fight for their children and for their memory. The mothers of Plaza de Mayo are a symbol of courage in the relentless battle for justice, truth and memory.